why are you up so early? <laughs> I'll talk, I'll talk. We brought our water bottles with us to London because we're slowly learning from our trip to Lush. But we decided to sit in and enjoy the juice because we thought that then they would be like reused, not reusable cups, you know, like a proper mug and like a proper glass. But instead what's happened is that we've got like a plastic cup and a paper cup. Do you know how many years I used to love plastic cups back in the day? Anyway, we're in London today because we're going to the Imperial War Museum, bright and early. Basically, there's like a film called They Shall Not Grow Old, which is created from all old footage um, by Peter Jackson, which Ryan's really jealous about because, well, he did like Lord of the Rings and Hobbit and all the cool films. Um, so, yeah, I'm really interested to see because I don't really know that much about history and I've never actually been to the Imperial War Museum, so I'm just gonna learn loads, I think. And it's gonna be really cool, but I'm also really interested to see how Peter Jackson's used the old footage and recreated like a film of it because he's turned like the black and white film into like colour and he's had it like effects and I think it's in 3D and stuff so it's super cool and um, yeah I'm really excited I'm just really interested I have no idea what to expect <laughs> What we have to cross here, to cross there, to go all the way back there. I'm so confused, guys. So walking through Woking, trying to find my dad, and we just walked past where Amelia got her hair dyed. And then we remembered that we never actually showed you Amelia getting her hair dyed because uh, we didn't upload a vlog that week. So let's see Amelia getting her hair dyed. Yay! So as you can't tell, this is the colour I'm going. And I have the lovely Georgia. I'm pretty sure you know Georgia. <laughs> have you been in my vlogs before yet? No, I haven't. You haven't? Oh, well Georgia used to do my hair before she worked at the salon. Now she does my hair that she does work at the salon. <laughs> that didn't make much sense. But yeah, no, I'm excited. I shouldn't, I shouldn't be looking at my shoes. So the whole reason we went to the Imperial War Museum was because of the film They Shall Not Grow Old. It was co-commissioned by 14 to 18 Now and Imperial War Museums in association with the BBC, which is pretty cool. Basically, the whole concept of the film is to bring the reality of war and the front line to life for a new generation. Because the war is getting further and further away in our timeline as the years go on, but the young generation still should know about it and it's still very important and it does bring it to life. When I was learning more about the film and when I was learning more about the museum and just more about the, the war, I didn't know this much. Sometimes you think about the war and you kind of forget that it was real people and you kind of forget it was real stories. So I had such a good day and I'm really grateful for them sponsoring me. It's been such an educational experience and something that I don't think I would have usually done. So thank you. If you want more information, it'll be in the link down below, and I'm going to get on with the rest of my day. I've got some work to do. Bye. Pete, where are we? 
Uh, we're in Cambodia. We're in Brighton, back in the artist residence, which is really nice. We've been here for one night, one half a day already. The reason I haven't vlogged is because um, I didn't have an SD card with me, so being memory card so being all like dedicated I went out to Argos for a while but we had a really nice time so far and hopefully we'll take you with us basically visit Brighton were really kind and offered us <laughs> sorry offered us tickets um, to go around some of the attractions and one of them was the British I-60 I and this is right in front of our hotel so we were like we should try it but there's more over that way's Hove I like that Whoa, we are very high but, but do you know what I mean like it's actually not that's bad. our hotel there yeah shown you our hotel room and the reason for that is that it's we've made it really messy me and Pete moved the chairs yesterday so we could watch the TV um, there's the bath we've been using like daily here's the lovely view this is literally like my favorite hotel good morning everybody oh gosh I look tired looks like I've just got out of bed and put some makeup on to go for breakfast which is exactly what's happened I cooked English breakfast hopefully we can get a table probably won't the weather is disgusting, you can't really see it, but it's horrible, it's wet, it's feeling cold, and I think winter is finally coming. Autumn. Pardon? Autumn's here. Oh, no, autumn was already here, that was at the beginning of October. I mean, it's not actually like November's winter, isn't it? No. Oh. Gone for a flat white, I've gone for an apple juice, and then Ryan's copied me with an apple juice and a flat white, as usual. Oh, that was a good breakfast. Now, we're in Farnham Town oh, Centre oh, and I'm oh, hoping went in. <gasps> we can go to Oliver Bonus. A new Oliver Bonus has just opened. Well, not a new one, but it is new. But an Oliver Bonus has just opened in Farnham Town Centre and I'm very excited to go and have a look. And it's finally open. Um, yeah, it's very exciting. Oh, look at it. First Space NK, now Oliver <laughs> Bonus. Look at it. Hi guys, I'm at Brewdog with Peter. And it's really bad. It's like midday and we're having a pint. I've got a dead pony club and you've got... Oh, we're at Vino. <laughs> Pete has palm ham. Oh yeah, palm ham, mozzarella, mozzarella. Mm, mm, mm. And Pete's favourite beer, Menabrea. One or your fave, but one of your faves. Uh, Pete has run me the biggest bath ever, like, because he's a babe. We love coming back here, it's really nice. Start off our... Uh, Lovely, amazing, and I should do deal them. You should do deal them. But their IPAs <laughs> are even better. Let me try that. Mmm. Is that what we had at the Jamie Oliver thing? No, I don't think it. It looked like that though, didn't it? Yeah. And it's now the weekend. Well, I feel like it might look like I've only worn this T-shirt for the whole week. It's kind of true, it's because I've just discovered that I've got it again in my wardrobe, so fancied. <gasps> Juno, that was so rude. I was about to film you, and then she just huffed off the sofa and went and slept in the, in the chimney. Can you see her? Ryan is currently trying to make a speaker that I got from um, Bedhead. I got sent like loads of hair products, and so Ryan is making a speaker right now. I think it's missing pieces. Really? There's no cables for the, the speakers. I'm sure there isn't. Maybe if you just read the instructions. I Ryan doesn't like, like to read the instructions. And he calls himself a scientist and has trouble making this. I bet you I'll do it. I'm watching Grey's Anatomy. We're having a chilled weekend, but I am editing the vlog ahead of Monday, um, which is why I'm ending it now. Hope you're all right with that. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you check in the description because we've got loads of links down there and like we actually have this week. I know I usually say that. We've got a link for the movie They Shall Not Grow Old. I want to say thank you for them uh, for sponsoring this video. Haven't seen the film yet but Ryan literally asked without knowing that they'd sponsored this vlog if we could go and see it next week. So I'm going to go see it with your dad. No, I'm going to. I want to see it. I know but I feel like you're just not into history enough. 
That's not true. That's a, I didn't like that. I don't <laughs> like that stereotype that you're giving there, Ryan. So, our podcast is on Spotify now. Yaha! Dance friend, I'm dance. Famous, Mom. So, um, the link for that is down below. And then also, thank you to Carter and Shields, the hairdressers, for doing Amelia's hair. If you'd like 50% off, guys, then I think there's a code that you can use. It's Amelia50. If you're in the area, go there, have your hair cut, 50% off. Might as well share that because, um, Actually, I might get that done. That's a pretty good deal. 50% off is a lot. Um, and there are also some links down below about Amelia's book as well. There's loads of cool stuff that's popping up about Amelia's book. I don't know what she's releasing yet and what she's not. So I'm not going to tell you anything. But yeah, it's exciting and I'm excited for her. Um, I think that's all this stuff in the description. Probably isn't. There's probably more. For once, there's actually loads of stuff down there. Um, thank you very much for watching, guys. And we will see you on Thursday.